10.4 Sydney continues to include a number of changes and enhancements around Get It, the integrated package manager for Rad Studio, Delphi, and C++ Builder. A few notable changes include that you can now sort the Git window by release date, which is a great way for finding out new packages that have been added. You can also get hot fixes and patches via Git it. And we've added a update subscription only area where you will continue to find great value added features as part of your update subscription contract. Another big change in 10.4 is the offline and online installers have been unified. So you can take advantage of the platform selection features and adding and removing additional options, whether you use online or offline installers. This is great if you find yourself needing to switch between installers with updates in the future as well. Expanded the selection of C++ libraries available through Git. Uh, here's a few of them here. Check in there, we'll be adding more as time goes by and updating them as well. Just sort by what's new under C++ libraries. The discovery and installation of patches and hotfixes is now uh, on the welcome page and also in Git. So you can see right now I have a patch available. I can also go into Git it. And right here I can see the patch with the additional details on it. So the great thing is I can click this and install this hotfix or patch quickly and easily. And it's not a matter of hunting things down, finding it on the website or installing it manually. And it's done. Uh, it'll restart your IDE if necessary. The new unified installer means whether you use the offline or online installer, you'll now have access to the platform and extension manager from the welcome page. It's also from the tools menu. From here, you can come in and add new platforms or uh, additional options, add or remove additional options. If, for example, you've just learned French and need to change it. Also new in Get It is you can now sort by date to see what's newest. You can get a list of only things that you've installed and also things that are updated. We also have listings for subscription only things. So these are premium add-ons that are only available for update subscription. Uh, they're expect to see more of this in the near future that will be exclusive in here. Uh, as we're adding more things, they'll show up in here, like the Navigator, Bookmarks, uh, FMX Linux. If I scroll down here, it's in here as well. FMX Linux. So that is really useful uh, place to take advantage of some of the benefits of update subscription. Sample projects is someplace we've also added more so we have like the order entry app template these games here android kiosk mode shows you how to take advantage of the new kiosk mode feature in android uh, rad server installations login screens this is some place we're going to continue to add more and more features to as well um, so some place to check out good place to find resources for if you're getting started with a new application uh, maybe a template you can use to start with under C++ libraries, this is where you can find the various C++ libraries that have been added that work with C++ Builder. These are common libraries like SDL, uh, iGen, TinyXML, etc. that are adapted to work with C++ Builder. This is someplace you'll also see a lot more updates coming in the near future.